I'm Randolph M. Hirsch. I'm the screenwriter for an up-and-coming independent feature film called Once in a Lifetime, Just Go For It. It's a romantic, character-driven, emotional drama. It's got a leading male by the name of Mitch, and Mitch is going through a horrible divorce, very bitter divorce, and watching his business crumble right in front of his eyes. Then there's the female lead, Jennifer. Jennifer is a hard-working single mom who works at a local firm. And then there's the little girl who is eight years old, Molly. The whole story kind of centers around Molly. She's watched her mom go on a series of really bad, pathetic blind dates recently. Her mom's just trying to find someone, someone nice. Molly's never met her real father. So she just wants a few things in life, to see her mom happy and to have somewhat of a normal family life, uh, which is kind of rare these days. And to have a little brother or sister. She doesn't care which, she just wants a sibling. 10 years ago, I wrote a short film, 20 minute short, same name, once in a lifetime, go for it. I and mean, I sent it off to the New York Short Film Festival and it got accepted and, and it was screened out there and I went to New York and it was very exciting. When I came back from New York from that experience, I was super pumped and I ended up turning the short film into a feature length screenplay. I was this close back then to going into pre-production. And then life got in the way. Some things happened, and uh, I had to put everything on the back burner all these years. Um, I raised a daughter. My daughter's actually in the short film. Um, started in accounting and tax practice and consulting practice. And then we had the real estate crisis in this country. I had to fight for my home, and, and uh, just life got in the way. Years and years passed, and, and I, I built up the practice that I had, and three months ago, had some medical issues. I ended up collapsing at the office from high blood pressure and hypertension, and I was hospitalized. I had been a smoker my entire adult life. I smoked uh, probably a pack a day. I was a Marlboro Lights guy. Thank God for Obamacare affordable health insurance because I was in the hospital for two weeks. Uh, the first six days I was in intensive care. Uh, I had lost my ability to walk. I had a minor stroke and a blood clot had traveled to my brain and cut off the oxygen and blood flow to my brain for a couple of minutes, affecting my ability to walk, my balance and my equilibrium. Luckily, I was given a second chance. I'm still talking, I'm still walking, I'm back to work, I'm getting healthy, I'm 90% recovered already in just three months. It's a miracle, it really is a second chance because most people, I met a lot of people in the, uh, the ward uh, while I was there recovering in the hospital bed who will never get a chance to talk normally again, to walk normally again, to go back to run their businesses again. So I consider this a second chance in life. And while I was laying there in the bed, staring at the ceiling every night, I thought about this beautiful screenplay that I wrote. I said to myself, you know, Randy, you only live once. Just go for it. Get it made. As soon as I got back on my feet and back to work and started recovering, I announced development. We start filming on May 1st for three weeks. And there's no stopping us this time. We're getting this film made. I appreciate any help that you can contribute to us, and we'll see you at the movies.